Welcome to our series of 12 appliance. We are on appliance number three of 12 appliances that are yet to come. If you haven't followed the previous ones, go back to the episodes of the series. This device is called Pendulum Expander, which consists of an acrylic button similar to a house appliance, but it differs from the appliance to house due to these TMA springs that are placed at the back of the acrylic. Notice that the Pendulum Expander appliance is not only used as a space regainer. In fact, I prefer to use it this way, but it can also be used for class 2 treatment, as in this case of a patient who was class 2N, had no space for the permanent canines. The purpose of these springs is to distalize the molars. So, how do I perform the activation? With burnt beak pliers, grab the round part of these extensions and that way you can activate it in the direction of the mid-palatal suture. Ideally, there should be an activation of 200 to 250 grams, and it's also ideal to keep this posterior part until it is parallel to the mid-palatal suture. Afterward, you can measure the force and even reduce the activation if necessary. During the manipulation of the patient's mouth, it's useful to use the wing guard pliers, and throughout the month, we will have this active force because it's a TMA spring, and this molar will gradually move to the back, recovering space or correcting class two. Did you like this appliance? Then follow our series of 12 appliances. We are on appliance number three. Stay tuned for appliance number four.